All right, what's going on, guys? Your boy Terabar reacts here, and I'm back with another episode of Evangelion. Um, we just saw Shinji got his chest blown out in that in the EVA. Um, so by this new angel that showed up on the scene. So I'm looking forward to see what happened, but make sure you guys go and check out my last Ippo reaction if when you get a chance. Um, yeah, things got a little emotional there because it was the last super reaction. Um, yeah, things got a bit emotional over there. So I'm actually recouping from that right now because I did this. I'm doing this directly after I finish that reaction and I'm still in recovery mode. You know, um, that anime means it, it meant a lot to me over the past three months that I've done it um, from season one to season three was it was a hell of a ride. And I know I'm going to miss it. I just know I'm going to miss it. So, thank you guys for coming over here and watching this, man. It um, We're jumping into that. Um, her name is Misato, right? The girl that's taking care of Shinji. Um, the officer. What is she? A captain, right? Um, yeah. So, I'm looking forward to see what's going to take place. Now, we learned a little bit about Ray in the last episode. So, um... This anime is revving up to be something cool too, you know. As I've said before, this is this anime is definitely not about the fighting; it's about the individuals, you know. And I'm glad, I'm happy, you know. So I'm gonna be analyzing the shit out of this anime. So thank you guys for watching. As always, I'm gonna go watch this. So make sure you tune back in for the review. I will see you then. Thank you guys for coming by. Make sure you go watch. Watch the reaction, come back for the review, man. Let's go. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Terry White, right back here again with that review. Thank you guys for going over to the Google Drive and checking out this reaction, okay? Um, it's been an awesome ride so far with this anime, man. Six episodes in, and this one. I enjoyed it because it had one of my favorite weapons to be ever created, the sniper rifle. Okay, um, even though it was like a laser beam sniper rifle, still cool as hell to see the EVA is trying to take an angel out from far, okay? Um, so definitely enjoyed that episode, um, that aspect of it. Um, seems like Ray and Shinji is getting close. They're getting closer, and they should, as they should. If I was the writer of the show, I would write them to become close because they're both doing the same thing but having different experiences. It's from two different perspectives, but they're doing the same thing. They're both trying to save the world, pretty much, but they have two different perspectives on it. So it's like... Um, Ray almost getting hurt. Yeah, I was actually genuinely worried about her because she takes so much, you know, and as you can see there at the end when Shinji was talking to her, she does not know how to respond to, to an emotion like crying. So that goes to say, like, what has she been through? Like, how long has she been piloting EVAs? You know what I'm saying? You know. If she and Shinji's around the same age, she couldn't have started that much earlier than him. Because, I mean, they have to be a certain age, right, to do it. So, I don't know. How long has she been in the program? I don't know. You know, so, you know, then we got the, cla the classmates, you know, sneaking out. Him hacking his dad's computer to get the itinerary and know where the EVAs was going to come out. Um, So, that, they, they thought it was so cool. And, they, you know... <sighs> You know what I mean? So, they, and they almost died. But, um, as I said before, as I was trying to explain during the episode, what I was saying about the, the, um, the situation between them is, um, between Ray and Shinji and, you know, it's, it, it's just so crazy to see, um, what kind of soldier she is. You know what I'm saying? What makes she feel, she kind of looks like she feels like this weird emotion um, or 
she feels like she has to do this somehow. She has to do it so she's ready anytime they call. Because she's not a robot by any means. She's a human, just like every, anybody else, unless she turns out to be a freaking robot later on that we don't know about. But right now, you know, I mean, she, she got titties, so she human. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Uh, unless it's one of these blow up dolls, you see, they look so realistic. These sex dolls these days is ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but definitely a great episode, man. Moving the story right along, man. That setup took forever. Um, but that is how it is when you have when you're gonna fire a high powered weapon like that. You know, it takes time. You gotta charge up and all of this other stuff. Um to get ready to be at full power right else they wouldn't have been able to take it thank god shinji was able to take that shot and hit it he was able to focus um i kind of missed it the first time when they fight because i was like why is there two going at each other like i didn't even see i i, I must have blinked and missed when the angel fired you know so i went back a little bit hope you guys didn't mind that um but definitely man this anime is definitely shaping up to be a very good one so i'm curious to see what's gonna happen next because shinji has i don't know what kind of connection he feels with ray but i don't know why he was crying either i was wondering why he was crying um he was genuinely worried about it but there was no reason to cry in that situation like the crying was a bit excessive <laughs> you know what i'm saying or maybe it's because he knows what she has been through um you know what i mean but does he know the extent of what she's been through though you know what i mean like even though he's been in the situation or maybe that's the connection between them now whereas in i know what you've been through because i'm going through it now you know what i mean because i've been in the eva i got crushed and they just as soon as i'm conscious i'm back in here you know what i'm saying so maybe that it's that connection that they have right now i'm just trying to connect dots um you know, you guys are telling me, oh, all will be revealed. Don't worry. Um, Hopefully, <laughs> you know, so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing more of this anime, man. Thursday is the next reaction, guys. So don't forget um, Tuesdays and Thursdays in our anime day. So we have Code Geass super, um, super reaction coming up on Thursday, along with another episode of Evangelion. Um, and make sure you remember to vote on that poll when it comes out and make sure i have it out by tomorrow by the time you have this episode you should have that poll to vote on okay it's for which anime i should add to it i'm not going to be doing more than three so don't expect much <laughs> at a time okay so it's just one more i'm adding and i want it to be a modern one um because i'm already doing classics so when one classic is over so when I'm done with another classic, I'm going to add another classic. But I want to have two classics running and a modern one. So I'm going to put it out out there. Somebody suggested One Punch Man. Who the hell is One Punch Man? Um, who's One Punch Man? I've never heard of this guy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, I, I, let me see. Maybe I have. No, not ringing a bell. One Punch Man. I mean, I mean, I, I'm not around the anime. I mean, I've heard of, um, have I heard of One Punch Man? Has it been that long? I wonder if I've watched One Punch Man. I, I, I'm telling you, man, I'm so busy these days. Like so many things slip my mind as I'm getting older. I'm not getting dumb or anything. It's just that as you as you get older, you start to forget things. No matter, I might look young, but this is an old mind, okay? This brain is old. So much information is in this brain. So I tend to compartmentalize a lot of things. So, um, or shove it to the side. Um, I don't know if I've watched one. From, I'm going to have to look it up to make sure if I've watched it already or not. Um, but it does now that i'm thinking about it it may ring a bell so i don't want to say i have or i have not watched it um or maybe i started and didn't finish i don't know because there's a lot of animes that i started and didn't finish so i don't know just like how i started to watch hunter hunter and didn't continue 
even though it was a really good anime i didn't follow up with it right um as i told you guys before hunter hunter um i watched it up to they were running in a tunnel or something for the for the um the hunter exam it was like probably like it five episodes in or something like about five episodes in and i never went back to it i never went back it wasn't boring or anything to me it, it's it was developing nice the story was great um but i just stopped watching it i don't know why stuff get a lot of stuff get in my way my early to late 20s bro like it was nuts okay like so much stuff that i've been through it, it's just if i should sit down and really talk with you guys man <laughs> it will take me take you hours to just listen to me i can talk for hours about the stuff that i went through just in my those 10 years of my life 20 to 30 it, it's just nuts okay so um so thank you guys for coming over and watching man looking forward to more episodes of this if you have not subscribed to the channel yet make sure you subscribe you know we're tr our next goal is 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 um 1500 our next big milestone is to get to 1500 subscribers and then on to 2000 subscribers of course we're close to 1300 right now so hit that subscribe button man hit that notification bell hit that like button of course and leave a comment on the video tell me what you expect um and stop bro no spoilers please no spoilers thank god i have uh monitors on my channel man um, so thank you guys um, for watching. As always, it's your boy Terabyte Reacts. Peace.